Hi, this is Paul from paulrobbie.com. I have just completed the currencies trading zones uh, spreadsheet. It, it will be available very soon. I just wanted to go through what it means and how to put it on your chart. So I'm going to take Euro US dollar for example here. Where it says H, that's the high of the zone. So you're just drawing a rectangle basically and extending it left and right. Uh, and where it says L, that's the low of the rectangle. And these are all the highs and lows of the zones that I've put in right now. So these are good uh, for the next two or three months. I've made them all temporary because I don't trade all of these. My stones are very, my zones are very sticky um, no matter what I trade. But I want to see how many of these are tested regularly and so I can test them just over the next few months. So really these will only start to become permanent uh, towards the end of January 2021 and also I may be adding more in there so if I add more they will be in yellow uh, and I'll announce that so let's go euro US dollar here uh, the top zone here 12097 uh, 120746 so on the chart all I've got on my chart here remember I'm drawing these on the 60 minute chart uh, so I, when I draw the rectangle, I'm using the, this is trading view, I'm drawing the drawing tool there for the rectangle, very, very simple. And then I adjust it just to give me the actual coordinates dead on here. And I can extend it out to three, four thousand. So uh, I draw the, the rectangle roughly along those prices and then I will put exactly what is in uh, those highs and lows on there so I've got the rectangle zone perfect on there and just keep adding them and this is what your chart should look like on the 60 minute chart for your US dollar once you put those zones in okay then remember when we're trading on the three the five the 15 minute we trade between the zones okay and the better trades are the ones that come to test the zones okay so here we see massive massive resistance then we get a six star sell we go below all of these lows here so I'll just draw that in there for you here okay so we get the six star sell coming from this big resistance zone we go low we go short below all of these lows and this was the trade okay then we come back up we come to test we get another six star sell here it wasn't a bad one didn't really take the stop out came back up to test the zone we have another go we get a four star we get another six star sell coming there lots of uh, risk to reward entry on this one would be just below all of this support here short term support we've come to test we've got higher um, into there then we get in lower resistance zones we get the six star sell boom all the way down okay so these are the zones remember don't trade into the zones we trade between the zones Hopefully that helps.